Okay. Uh, it was about a week ago, I took a walk out that door, and I started walking down the street, and uh, I saw a dog, it was all mangy, it had like, it didn't even have any fur, it was like patches of fur, with scabs, and it was, it, it looked at me with these eyes, and it was like, oh. Oh no! A scary dog came up to me, and I decided that I wanted to bite the dog and not let it bite me. So I ran up to it, and I bit it, and it cried, and then I ran off. <laughs> so the dog was like, <laughs> and it kept running, and I was just like, I just bit the dog. dog. That tasted like... Oh! <laughs> this is like chicken. <laughs> There was a bunch of dogs out there that tasted just like chicken. I don't know where to go with that one, but anyway. So, I'm in Vegas, and I'm at the buffet, and there's a bunch of dogs there that taste exactly like chicken. And they're all wearing your black pants. <laughs> no, 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 no. Then, and then, they were like, like these weird chicken fried things. They came up, and they were like breathing. And they looked at me with their eyes. Is it they're breathing then, or they're breathing? They're breathing. And then, and then they looked at me with their eyes. And then, and then, uh, then you ate. They looked at me with their eyes, and they told me that they needed a pedicure. So I got out my red toenail polish <laughs> that was called uh, the Big Apple. And I painted their toenails. And I clipped them. And... <laughs> it was on that moment that we realized that we weren't in Vegas, we were actually in Reno. <laughs> so, we're in Reno getting Big Apple paint on our toenails, getting a nice massage, and yes! the ladies were massaging our hands, and then, like, <laughs> we were just hanging out with these ladies, and uh, all of a sudden we heard these weird birds. <laughs> I was with Johnny in Reno, and I thought I was in Vegas too for a little bit. But then I looked up, and there was a Nevada state trooper, and he was like, dude, you're in Reno, not Vegas. And I was like, holy shit. Officer, I am so sorry that I mistook what city I was in. Because now I realize there's all these pretty mountains around me, and it is not big buildings in the desert. And so Johnny was like, State Trooper, he's a little fucked up, so please don't mind him. And, and so then what ensued will be told by the next man in the line. Well, who was sued was actually the owner of the restaurant that the state trooper was on top of. It happened to be a Chinese restaurant that <laughs> happened to be whole game right here. where one of the special courses was, in fact, dog. Nice! With my toenail polish? Well, that's why that person got sued, because there were toenails 
in the darkness. Red toenails, you see. Yes! Big Apple red toenails. And I was one of those per people who actually saw one of those toenails. And when I saw it, I just thought. Out of control. <laughs> So we were in Reno, right? <laughs> and uh, after this court case happened, uh, the lawyer kind of, you know, approached me. He said, can you approach the bench with me? I didn't know what that meant. So I thought, well, okay. So I, so I walked over to his bench. And then he, he, asked me to, he asked me to sort of lean over a little bit. So I did. And uh, I felt him, I felt him sort of touch my, my back right here. And then, uh, and then he said, he was like, hey John, just, just be yourself. He was like, don't worry about it. You're, you're, you're at the bench now. Just be yourself. And I'm like, how is that supposed to work? <laughs> I'm like, I'm in court. I just got briefed by some lawyer, you know, I'm supposed to lie. And so he reached over and touched my butt again. <laughs> what are we talking about? <laughs>